Welcome to El Calafate. We are in southern Argentina, in the province of Santa Cruz. The mission is called the Airbus Perlin Mission 2. And the reason we're here is the greatest stratospheric mountain waves in the world exist only in a couple of places, and Argentina is one of them. And we use those waves to climb to incredible altitudes using a motorless airplane, a glider. Part of what the Perlin Project is dedicated to studying is how do these mountain waves change the conditions that we live on in the planet. It affects everything from uh, uh, farmers knowing what crops to grow and how much moisture they're going to get to the safety of airliners flying in the stratosphere. Uh, the Perlin aircraft itself is, is a unique airplane. It's, it's doing something that no other airplane has ever done. If it achieves 90,000 feet, it'll be the highest flying airplane to ever be supported by its wings at that altitude. The partnership with Airbus has been a wonderful uh, cooperative arrangement for the Perlin project. Airbus uh, joined with us for a number of reasons. Uh, one was the inspiration. Airbus needs uh, the best and the brightest engineers, and uh, Perlin hopefully will inspire students to become excited about cutting edge things in aviation and engineering. Well, the most significant thing that makes the Perlin II capable of flying to high altitude is a pressurization system. As we go to altitude, the human body does not have enough oxygen if you don't have either a pressurized environment or an oxygen system. But even an oxygen system can't provide enough oxygen above about 43,000 feet. So by having the pressurized cabin, we have an environment that's safe for the crew to very high altitudes. This program is very weather dependent because the conditions that cause the high altitude waves only occur a few days a year and some years they may not occur at all. For the future we will be making improvements to the airplane. Anytime you fly an airplane that's a research vehicle you'll learn things and over time we can improve uh, the systems that are in the airplane and make them more efficient and improve the safety aspects of it. So we'll take the airplane home after this uh, trip to Argentina and we'll make some upgrades and we'll come back next year with an even better airplane.